Hello, it's Helder here, and today I want to talk to you about these S2V military and tactical boots by Rocky Boots. Now, normally I review minimalist type footwear, and that's what I choose to wear pretty much on a daily basis. But there are times when I need to be uniform compliant, and these Rocky Boots come right in and fill in that gap with a ton of comfort and great specs that of course you would expect from rocky boots so i was sent these boots to review uh, one of the first things i did was go on a five mile ruck with my dog to be able to test these out without even a break-in period and if you want to know more about the results and my findings stay tuned when it comes to these boots there are a lot of specifications i will of course mention some of them in this video review but I will have a complete list of all these specs and uh, extra information that you might need and want. And I will place that information in my blog post. And I will link that post in the top right now, as well as in the comments field below. I unboxed these boots, put them on because I was pretty much ready to uh, go on a ruck. Even though I was thinking, you know what, I'm probably going to regret it later and uh, end up with some hot spots and blisters. And to be honest with you finished the five mile ruck with uh, probably about a 25 pound rucksack and my dog which uh, likes to pull left and right here and there which doesn't always make things too pleasurable and when I was finished my feet were good to go they were just as good as they were before I put these boots on so uh, let's just say I was definitely impressed but I really didn't expect anything less from Rocky boots just as soon as I picked them up felt the construction felt the flexibility as well as the extra support. So as I was out there uh, rucking with my dog, I try to hit as much different terrain as possible from rocky terrain to grass, sand, mud, uh, just to see how the traction was, how things held up. Definitely a thumbs up. The stability was there. I didn't slip anywhere regardless of the terrain. And more importantly, the comfort, it really felt very comfortable. And as I uh, alluded to earlier, I prefer a minimalist uh, shoe for everyday activities. So that's what I was used to, a lot of comfort. And uh, having these on, uh, to be honest with you, only when I looked down or when I thought about things or trying to get some video of uh, me actually wearing the boots on the ruck, that's when I noticed that I actually had these on. As opposed to other shoes, these boots are OCP or operational camouflage pattern approved. So they're good to go for many military applications and fit those standards. And these Rocky boots are made in the USA. As you can tell, they have a Vibram or Vibram sole. After all these decades, I still don't know how to pronounce that name, but I definitely could vouch for Vibram since I have been using them over the decade on various shoes and they are pretty much the standard when it comes to quality boots and other footwear. Comes in this coyote brown color and is berry compliant. These boots are eight inches in height. Uh, they weigh in, this is a men's size 11 and a half US, which weighs in just under four and a half pounds. Some of the features on these Rocky boots is that they are water resistant, made of leather. They are 1000D Cordura. They have ear ports and a cushion footbed, allowing air to flow in and of course, water to get out. There's a fiberglass shank, and of course, the speed laces, which uh, make getting them on and off that much easier. And these heels are about an inch and a half, which add about an inch and a half to your height, which is uh, never a bad thing when you're in uniform and or on the job. Even with the design, as far as the toe box, my toes weren't all scrunched up uh, the way I would feel with uh, other military issue type boots so that's good to go allows my feet to be a lot more natural making it more comfortable especially when you're tacking on some miles on these longer rucks and you're bearing a decent amount of weight in your kit they are ptfe coated which makes them fire resistant and there is a roll stop ankle support for stability so good to go uh, once again a lot more specs and I will put them in a blog post, so be sure to check that out. So bottom line, if you are looking for a pair 
of boots for military and tactical purposes. Definitely take a look at these Rockies. Now keep in mind back in the day, these were the boots that I was uh, used to wearing while on active duty in the Marine Corps. And uh, heck of a difference. Super heavy, not very comfortable. And these don't require a spit shine. 